Hello everybody and welcome back to Analog Vernacular. Today we're going to be playing some more Unicorn Overlord. We've got a rapport conversation here. I can't remember if we had more after this, but uh, we'll see. We'll see soon. But let's go ahead and do this one first. Adeline and Clive. You know, Adel, training like this delivers my mind straight to our days coming through the Order. I was just thinking the same thing. I'm amazed we even survived it. Ooh, okay. Flashbacks. Commander. Faster, Clive. Even the slowest foot soldier could dodge such languid thrusts. Understood, sir. And you're lacking accuracy, Adel. Speed means nothing if you don't even land a simple blow. Thank you, sir. That's enough for now. Convene with the infantry for joint maneuvers. Move. Strict though he might have been, the captain bore great kindness as well. Do you remember the days Zenoira invaded our province? He sent us to the rear guard and took to the front line himself to lead the charge. I was furious, sick of being treated like a damn child who could barely hold a spear. But I realize now it wasn't a lack of confidence that motivated the commander. He was protecting us. Indeed. The captain entrusted us with the future of our order and the future of Fevreth. Which is the only reason we stand here today. Difficult as it was at the time, we owe him our lives. So many have lost friends and family to this war, losses which must be avenged. And strength is the only way we'll see it happen. I couldn't agree more. We must further hone our spears, as the captain said, and do proud those who keep faith in us. His Highness, most of all. Ah, come, Clive. We've got training to do. Bro moment. Alright. I've got my coffee. It's a Sunday morning. We're gonna be playing some Unicorn Overlord. I am feeling good. Okay. Um, let's see. One thing that I wanted to double check is to make sure that I haven't forgotten to station people, so it looks like we're good on that front. Okay, I haven't actually gotten to that one yet. I haven't gotten to that one yet. Okay, I guess if they're black, you can't travel to them. If they're that gold color that we see right here, we can. Okay, is that the only one we haven't finished? Yes. All right, let's check it real quick. Okay, three more tilapia. Okay, stuff here hasn't been replenished. Or it's being collected somewhere that we can't access. Okay. Now, let's check some levels. So, first off, what level am I at right now? Keep pushing the wrong damn button. Okay, so looks like uh, our high level, I, I, we'll kind of base it off of Elaine. 15 seems to be where most people are at. We're, some people are lower, obviously, but. So like 12 to 15 seems to be where we're at. I think this was like, um, yeah, so that's a 15, that's a 16. I think we need to push a little bit further into Drakenhold before we start doing Elfheim, but we might start jumping between the two. So there's that. We've got 14 here, 13 there, 13 there, 14. All right, so let's figure out what our next level here is going to be. Monument to Animoy. I'm sure I pronounced that perfectly. Oh yeah, we didn't know what this did. 
Okay, so we've got nothing to work on for that. And we're gonna start moving forward. This group has a lot of defense. Good. Five birds with one stone? Vanquished a five-member unit in just one battle. Oh, really? That's the first time we've done that, huh? Cool. I'll take it. Flutina. The rebels here? Uh, fine then, I'll teach you what happens to rats like you. The battle for Galfa. Okay, and it's a level 12. The Liberation Army sets out to defeat Flotina and free Galfa Town from Zenoira rule. Okay, this one's a liberation. Arbalists and fighters. Okay, this one will probably be much smaller and much quicker. Okay. So we have lots of infantry and we've got some armored guys. So we're gonna wanna be able to get through the armored guy first and then we want to be able to use probably like uh, some infantry or um, not infantry, but um, some cavalry to get through some of those infantry groups. Maybe we'll avoid flyers in this one. This is the arbalist. Okay. Okay, so this group is gonna probably go out. Armor Slayer group. A test for my magic. I'll show you what a witch can do. Don't worry. I ride for Cornea. I'm ever in your service. They'll be going in after. Okay, maybe I want a group that'll be good against these flyers. So, true strikes, anybody who can hit. Yeah, you can actually do decent damage to flyers because of, uh, uh, what's her name? Virginia, that's right. Virginia has a thing against flyers. Chloe has a thing against flyers. Anybody with a bow. That was the Guess wrong group. <laughs> Not a problem. Where to? Okay, I can just tell them to straight up withdraw. On my way. Your fate is sealed. I'm here to help. This is a hot group right here. Every bunch of hotties in here. Yeah, even you, Joseph. <laughs> He's there for the people who enjoy the silver foxes. Switch him out for Berengaria, and that's gonna be like my waifu group. Waifu unit. Ever weaker. 
Seems we've done it. Freaking cavalry group On over my here. Honor as a knight. Okay, Cavalier Call activates before attacking with an active seal, grants cavalry allies in the user's row 20% attack, effects stacks. Was fate which Let's actually try here. and set that up right now. Oh, cool, I didn't even know I could do that. Um, that's the center pad, apparently you can see full-on map. What shall I do? Didn't even know that was a thing. Um, let's see, there we go. So Cavalier Call, is that one one of those limited ones? Effects stacks? Oh, you haven't learned it yet. Okay. But, you want them all in the same row. So let's see. Activates before attacking with an active skill. Grants cavalry allies in the user's row 20% attack effect stacks. Um, do you have the highest initiative? You have the same initiative as Adele. Adel. Gotta say that right. Gotta remember you have true thrust when we need it. Alright, let's see if that activates next time we uh, take this stuff. It shall be done. Simply say the word. I'm on my way. I'll prove my worth. Yeah, you're matching up really well Hi. against them. Got the sting of a scorpion. If I have to. Yeah, you're gonna do fine against those guys. Nobody's dying here. Um, hold on. Are you actually deploy with? Okay, you are on the thing. Good. Stand before me. I'm here. That's so good. That's so good. There's so many reasons why you'd want to split up your cavalry, but like when you put them together, this is such a good synergy. Allow me. A flawless victory. I'm ever in your service. I depart. It's ours. Your strength's not everything. Yeah. Come on then. Not even worth. With you all the way. No more hurt. Incredible. I'm done with you. Wow, I wasn't expecting him to hit. Not with their evasion. I'm impressed. Well done. Keen Call activates before an ally attacks. Grants 100% critical rate for an ally's next attack. 100% critical? Oh my goodness. Okay, so we might want to pair you with one of our... I don't know, sword masters I think are decent crit people, right? I don't know, we'd have to see. Maybe since they already naturally are a little bit more prone to critting, maybe that's not even the best way to do that, but... There's always more to learn. Hmm. Too weak. That's cool, though. Alright. If we wanted to, we could turn you into... Bruno being the leader, and then you could get through these a little bit quicker for us. I might actually need that. Nobody's dying here. This'll be fun. I shall never fail. Give in. We can do this. Ha! With my aid. The battle is ours. My lance grows ever sharper. 
A worthy foe. Just say the word. Stand before me. Ever weaker. All right. Victory we got to heal up short. Sylvie. The assists are adding up on her. Pain. She's almost dead. Seems we've done it. Victory. I'll show you what a witch can do. Need something? Heading over. Yeah, unfortunately they're trying to get us. Want Smart move on this? their part. Not today, though. my worth it shall be done what shall I do all right who's gonna be best against the boss here ready yeah I'm ever in your service I depart Simply say the word. Don't worry. I'll prove my worth. You know what? I'm just gonna have you go here. Yeah. So that you guys are together. I'm here, Your Highness. Or, well. <laughs> I shall never fail. Let's see what you're capable of. Prepare yourselves. You have my aid. Your vigor fades. We can do this. Your strength fails you! Allow me. A flawless victory! I require a respite. I'll show you what a witch can do. Need something? Easy. Yeah? Heading over. Just tell me if anyone needs. Do you need a healer? I'll do it. Time is with us. Should we only keep our focus? Your fate is sealed. My magic is yours. Magic should I grace you with? Stand before you want me to fight? I'm here. Better heal. Not bad. There you go. Big rapport games. Yeah, it's like I can't keep going. What is it? Two units that have decent relationships with each other. I understand. Brother and sister, and uh, soon to be lovers with Aramis and uh, Prim. <laughs> How 
I'll do everything I can. I shall. Your fate is sealed. I'll heal you. <sighs> Go on, then. <laughs> Yeah, those support attacks are definitely adding up. Hold fast. That must have hurt. How free you are solid. Be healed. There we go. Hell yeah. Maybe if I've depleted my magic. Completely topped off. Need something? Easy. Stand before hey, me. Hey, you want to die? I'm, I'm okay with that. I'll tend to your wounds. Together now. With my aid. In Never stood a the chance, dude. Are you impressed yet? Holy guard activates before being hit by a physical attack. Block an enemy attack with the medium guard and prevents debuffs. I'll need to study this further. I can ride no further. You want me to fight? Prepare yourselves. Let's see what you're capable of. Show me what you got. Bruno could use a level up. And let's add the healing assist because it will just give a little bit of extra experience to that. To that group or maybe just Prim, I don't actually know. I'll heal you. <laughs> Somebody in the comments let me know when uh when an assist happens, does the experience go to the entire unit? Getting stronger by the day. Cause when we go out to this menu, we're gonna see an experience thing pop over Prim's group. But I don't know if it's just going to Prim or if it's going to the whole unit. You see that, Magellan? Quick reload. Follow up attack a single enemy. Cool. 50 physical you potency, so half damage, but still. I didn't write the name down of this uh, liberation quest. It should just be the name of the town, right? It was the battle for and the name of the town. Galfa, right there, okay. Okay, so eight honors, deck of cards, and war funds. Deck of cards. Queen's Blood. We must play Queen's Blood. Oh, wrong game. I've been enjoying Queen's Blood in uh, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. So you're the Liberation Army everyone's been going on about. Color me impressed. Oh, and thanks for chasing those dams and oirons out of here. Cross the desert to make it here, did ya? Not used to seeing foreigners in these parts. We can't get anywhere near the border because of Zenoira. Not too keen on exploring the desert, either. The roads in Drakenhold are all pretty narrow. Not too many places to fit an army, though. It's a natural fortress, easy to defend, tough to attack. That's especially true of the capital. All that sand in your hair tells me you came here through the desert. Make sure to relax a bit. You've earned it. Oh, I think that's what we needed for that other area. For the other town. I gotta remember there's a deliver all button. Appreciate the help, kind soul. It's hard getting supplies in a remote town like this. I wonder if there will come a point where we don't actually have enough people to station. Got a keen eye on ya. My wares won't disappoint. Hmm. 
you got a deal. Your coin's welcome here. You won't find finer weapons in all of Drakenhold. Okay, max HP. Toughness. And there's one lethal blow. We've got one of those, yeah. Okay. The base passive is nice. The initiative isn't as nice. You're losing two physical defense. You're losing a little bit of initiative. Same guard efficiency. Much obliged. Yeah, we'll take it. Burn immunity. Be waiting for it. No one will get by on my watch. Not too often we get supplies through here, but thanks to you, we actually managed to rebuild. Not sure how we can ever repay you for that. Okay, and this one's done now, too. We don't get much aid from the kingdom out here, what with being stuck in the middle of the desert. For once in my life, I feel like someone's actually supporting us. Bless you, kind souls. Oh, we're getting so close. This should be fun. Must be hard crossing the desert with all those sandstorms. Why not rest a bit by the oasis? All right, let's just do a double check. I didn't actually, oh yeah, we do have so many of these. I think we only have one that's accessible right now though. So which one is it? Um, That one? Selvi and Monica? All right, let's go look at that one real quick. Um, It's up here in the corner. Oh, whoops. Nice try, bro. Hallowed Cornash. Ah. Uh, uh, what happened, Selfie? You look utterly exhausted. Is that you, Monica? I require nourishment. And you shall have it. Just stay strong while I fetch you some food. Thank you again, Monica. At times I grow so absorbed in my research I forget to eat for an entire day. Oh, I shudder to think what would have happened if I hadn't come when I did. Yet, in a sense, I can't help but admire your single-minded devotion to knowledge. Oh? When I was young, my parents kept me on an extremely strict schedule, one which saw my time devoted to my studies and little else. It was practically torture, being forced to learn day in and day out, and no matter how intently I watched the hourglass, the flow of its sands was always painfully slow. All that to say, I admire your motivation, Selvi. I can never find the energy to spur myself on as you have. Fascinating, yes. But I confess, my research is the only pleasure I know in life. Surely you have other joys which drive you forth, though. Joys beyond the pursuit of scholarship. Well, I suppose I do enjoy a nice cup of tea beneath a starlit sky. Yet my instructors shun such fanciful hobbies, and urge me ever towards the noble and sublime. Oh, seems pretty noble. How very callous of them. While it's true I delight in my research, it's not out of some vain search for the sublime. I simply found where my curiosity lay and chose to pledge my life to its calling, that's all. I hope to do the same as you someday. I'm sure you will, Monica, and I can't wait to see where your passion leads you. Okay, heartwarming. Nice try, bro. Nice try. Come and get me. Come and get come on, come on, come on, I dare you. Come on. Come on, come on. Oh, I actually almost got caught there. All right, now I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> Insult to injury. We're the baddies now. Easy now. We strike.
Okay. Where are we at? 36? Okay, everything is at 200, so we just need to start working on this once we get to 50. Uh, 3 to 4, and then we'll be done for a while. Um, because we can't do these until we're rank A. Okay. Let's make sure we didn't miss anything here. Um, so there's a circle over there, but I don't think we can access it. Until we do a full loop around? Yeah, yeah, we can't get over there. So somewhere up here we'll be able to access that. On we move. We've almost entirely stopped patrolling the coast. It's not like Zenoi was going to attack by sea anyway. Okay, so they... I mean... If this is where the capital of Zenoira is, they probably... I guess they just don't have a very good... naval force? You would think that if they took over the entire con... like, all of these different continents, they would have had to have had some form of naval force. So I'm actually surprised that they wouldn't have an option to attack by sea. Just seems like that's not their first go-to. Since I guess they still hold this area... Maybe it's just not seen as necessary yet? What am I doing out here, you ask? Truth is, I was imprisoned by Zenoya not too long ago, but then a long-haired swordsman came and broke us all free. Dude, is this Aramis again? Or is this some other long-haired swordsman? His blade work was really something else, beautiful and almost sad in a way. He must have been some kind of fallen noble, at least judging by his mannerisms. We keep getting hints, and I can't help but think... They keep on talking about how noble he is. Where is Aramis? Where are you, Aramis? Our list is getting too long to find easily. Right here. So, I wonder if you're a noble of some kind, and you're just trying to hide it. Oh, another bridge. Leads to one little house. I think it'll take 30 pieces of Cedronite. Okay, different type. If you really want to make it happen. Okay. Little house over there. Pardon the intrusion, my prince, but would you permit me to visit the cemetery? Due to her advanced age, our head cleric, Mother Lelia, asked me to offer prayers to the fallen spirits in her stead. Okay. Still haven't found all of the cornea ones. You have my deepest thanks, Elaine. The souls of the departed should rest easier now. Get some rapport with uh, Cher in there. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. Balmrot. This place is huge! Elmrot here is the largest town in all of Drakenhold, save the capital itself. They are especially proud of their Colosseum, too. Not that they're holding bouts here anymore. Well, now that we're here, I should be off to meet Prince Gilbert at once. Oh, maybe I'll take a look around the markets, then. Try not to get in any trouble, hmm? Prince Gilbert has been expecting you, right this way. Thank you both for coming. Okay, here's Gilbert. I take it you are Prince Elaine, commander of the Liberation Army and rightful heir to Cornea's throne. Indeed I am. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance, my king. I am no king. Merely Gilbert for now. My coronation must wait until Castle Soldraga is ours once more. Prince Gilbert, then. I've word that you request our aid. 
Just so. Ever since my father's demise in the tragic campaign against Zenoira, I have devoted myself to but one cause. To gather what survivors clung to life and fight onward for the past, present, and future of Drakenholt. Yet the battle which saw us win back Balmrata claimed many of our finest men, and morale has suffered accordingly. Hence you seek reinforcements. Correct. It wounds my pride to admit it, but I would suffer any injury before I see my people suffer worse. We march to vanquish Galerius and free all nations of Fevrith alike, including Drakenhold. We will join you. <laughs> You've quite the grand vision for yourself, seeking to unify the entire continent. And yet that vision is the beacon which draws soldiers to your ranks and fuels your army's unceasing advance. Tis but a dream for now, one that will remain as such unless we can recapture your palace. Sorry to interrupt this little war council. I've got word from one of our scouts. What is it? Zenoira approaches the Colosseum, and they bring a battalion of some size with them. <gasps> okay, so like, Berengari is like super tall, isn't she? <laughs> like if you put her just a little bit down next to uh, Virginia there, like, she's almost a head, not quite a head, but like half a head taller than her, it seems like. How large, exactly? Bit over four times our head I count. mean, they're all wearing if heels, but... Me, right? That's absurd! What shall we do, Prince Kilbert? Unfortunate as it may be, we lack the time necessary for any sort of elaborate preparation. We'll have to make do with what personnel we have. The catapults around our Colosseum walls will prove vital as well. So Berengaria is a general for his army, correct? And scant as our defenses are, it seems I have no choice but to sortie myself. We halt their advance together. See, because now I'm confused. I can't remember if she was supposed to be a general for uh, Zenoira's army, and then she did something that made her get arrested, or if she was a general for his army. She might have been a general for his army. Liza? Uh... Liza? What are you doing here? Oh, you know... Just making a bit of pocket change is all. Please don't tell the others. I wouldn't dream of it. Assuming this shop of yours is legitimate, that is. What kind of merchant do you take me for? It's all just trinkets and stuff that picked up in the ruins. But if Magellan or the gang knew about this, I'd never hear the end of it. Ugh, I don't even want to think about that. All right. We only just got Li Liza is the arbalist, correct? I'm pretty sure. Okay. <laughs> don't worry. We've met so many characters, it's hard to keep straight secrets. sometimes. Mind if I take a look? Yeah, be my guest. Though I don't have much worth buying. This one here is gorgeous. Oh, that old thing? I'll let you have it on the cheap if you want. End of day sale. Really? It'll just run you five mil, that's all. That's a bit beyond my budget. <laughs> I'm only teasing. Cute girl comes walking into my stall and I just can't help myself. <laughs> oh I was my. actually looking to offload the whole set. Go on and take him, free of charge. Whoa. Holy shit. What is it? <laughs> Jesus. Behind you. <laughs> She's huge. Oh. You two ever hear of manners? <laughs> Vanilla Ware has made a girl for every, every type. <laughs> Somebody just got, some, one of you watching right now just got so happy that there is a giantess in this game. Not really my type of thing, but I know, I know you, I know you are out there. I know you are. <laughs> I can feel the joy emanating uh, from you. I'll take that over the usual. Most people split the second they see me coming. Can I help you with something? What, split their legs? I, I mean, sure can. what did I just say? See, I'm new in town, <laughs> looking for the Coliseum. But everyone I ask goes all wide-eyed and runs off. There is a Coliseum here, yeah? There is, but I believe they've put competitions on hold until matters in the region improve. Scarlet comes up to her waist, dude. <laughs> I hear the prince is always out for spare steel, though. Why not try there if you're looking for work? 
I'm not looking. Prince might not be a bad idea, though. I'll see what I can squeeze out of him. <clears throat> oh, and thanks. What a woman. They're all gay for Amelia. They were straight a minute ago. They're all gay now. All right. So, let's take a quick look around. We're about 40 minutes. I don't think we can do whatever that mission is, so I may want to do some other optional things. Who is this? You cannot view this conversation until the surrounding area has stabilized. Okay, fair enough. You're going to tell us we can't go through here yet. Apologies, but you'll need Prince Gilbert's permission if you wish to proceed. Now let's see, this is one we haven't done yet, right? The trials. We also got some liberations, which are generally a little bit shorter. We might be able to do one liberation. A level 13 we can do. The Battle for Rivieri. The Liberation Army sets out to defeat Marwell and free Rivieri Town from Zenoiran and Bandit Rule. Witches and sword fighters. I'm ever in your service. I depart. Okay, I think we're gonna want our flyer group Let to once out. again hit this. We got some Griffin Knights. Who? Okay. And then. Is this group what doing okay do? against them? Hmm. Not particularly. Okay, these are the guys who can. They have lots of... The parries make it really difficult. I still don't have good counters for them that I am aware of. I know that the counter exists. So let's see. They have the parries there. I'm trying to remember. Nope, they do not have a way to gain more passive points, but this does give them extra action points. So you effectively have two action points each because of the parries. Your hit rate is true strikes and you have an extra bonus to critical rates. Okay. So honestly, the debuffs from you is still going to be fairly good. You're just not getting the attacks in. I'm up. What else do we got? So groups that can negate a ton of damage is probably going to be our best options, right? So, tanking a bunch of shit. This group has a lot of options for that. And they're all level 15s, though. I want to get level ups for some of the lower level people, you know? Is there anything I can do to make 13, 12, 14, 14? Um, I don't want Travis to go up against these guys because they have True Strike. So he's too soft to go up against True Strike Swordsman. He definitely won't be helpful. If we did just this group, how would they do? The day will be ours. I did it again. 
I keep on thinking that whatever one I'm editing, when I hit circle, it's gonna be on them, but it's on the... It's not. <laughs> okay, that group does do well against them, so we know that. The path is set. Stand before me! Bigger fades! So if the other group isn't good against sword fighters, Victory then... Is... God damn. A flawless victory. A worthy foe. I'm ever in your service. It shall be done. Just a moment. I shall never fail. Give in! Really high initiative, clearly. I shall ease your pain. The battle is ours. Yeah. She really, sh Barony should probably not be a frontliner if I remember correctly. So I want, let's, let's try this group. Just tell me if anyone needs heal, I'll help however I can. Okay, that seems to be working well. Um, I should have set leader. Oh, you're not even one of the axe wielders that can get through barricades. This group can though. I just need to deal with this first. What is it? Setting off. Prepare yourselves. Your strength fails you. Give some nerve. Ever weaker. Together now, we ride. I think that does a whole row, right? One of those offensives, I think, aid. does a whole row. If that's the case, then I might need to set it to do row with the most people or something. Seems we've done it. Let's actually check that because I'm not sure that's true. On a row of enemies and it is ranged. So row with most combatants. Yeah, for sure. Want some of this? Steady. Huh? <laughs> Gotta get moving. Better. <laughs> Come on, then. Not even worse. Just go on. <laughs> yeah! Oh, you can beat me. Enjoy that. I'm up. Sure, sure. I'll help however I can. I shall never fail. Prepare yourselves. In feet. Rip stamina. Your vigor fades. We can do this. Allow me. The battle is ours! I require a respite. What shall I do? They ready an attack. I'm in no rush. <laughs> I'm really in no rush.
I'll prove my worth. Yeah. I mean, hell, you could go all the way around before getting through the all that, but. I'm yet to claim victory. Stand before me. You want me to fight? I shall never fail. I won't fail you. Not finished yet. Cloud my judgment. Impale. Attack a single enemy. Grants a user plus one passive if the target is defeated. That's one defeated. I'll help however I can. I'll do it. Setting off. Your orders, sir. Need something? Heading over. What is it? I'll do it. What shall I do? I depart. Stand before me. I'll tend to your wounds. Your strength ever weaker. Huh? It's up to you. <laughs> Not let me go. I shall ease your pain. Seems we've done it. Okay, I've got yeah. two valors right now. What could I do here? I'm ever in your service. Do you need a healer? Okay, we'll do that. Initiative bonus for everybody. I understand. Prepare yourselves. You don't stand a chance. Okay, it looks like there's a sliver of health left after this. Some of this. I'll heal you. Better. You've got this. Are you okay? Guaranteed hit, baby. Now, guaranteed hit would still be parryable, right? Pretty sure. You see that? Or does true strike negate things like parry? I don't know. I'd have to look back to see if she used her parry before or not. I think she probably did. Okay, there we go. Thing you liberation folks came along, I didn't know what we were gonna do about those bandits. The country to the north, Bestorius, used to be run by a race of beast folk called the Bestrals. Until Zemira showed up, that is. It was a quick war, and most of the Bestrals got taken as slaves. Deliver all? I remembered it this time.
Thanks a bunch for fixing my roof. Now I don't have to use an umbrella inside anymore. <laughs> Sorry for laughing, kid. It's not even funny. Oakley's will watch over you. Or maybe to sell. Just say the word and it's yours. Thank you very much. Come back soon. If it's steel you're after, you're in the right place. Passive shatter. Removes the PP. <laughs> uh, what's wrong with me? We have one crushing axe already. That does uh, the stun? Yeah, inflicts stun. Be see Fear not. There's a lot of bad folks wandering these parts. Be careful out there. Okay, that's a level 13. This one was a 14. Oh yeah, and this had a bunch of, like, scrap and whatnot. Then we had a fight up here that I think was higher, right? This was a higher level? Yeah, that was 25. I think that leads into Bastorius. Do we have enough Corsite to repair this bridge? Probably is the same mission, but if we have it, why not? Okay, was it this town here that we could buy that for? So we need 30, and we have how many? So it's Corsite that I'm looking for. Only need 10 more. 20 blocks for 2,000 gold. Appreciate it. Looks like you've got the materials we need, Elaine. What do you say? Nothing like fixing up a wounded friend. You did good, kid. Our route to Grand Corinne lies just ahead, Your Highness. Proceed forth, and the final battle against Galeria shall commence in true. Level 40. Okay, so we got both of those bridges built. Good seeing you again, partner. Come on and take a look at what I've got. I'm gonna give this to you and I actually think what we're gonna do is give the Viper Fang to Travis now he has Poison Slash Support characters have a lot of options here. He 
give you another passive point. Those curing heals are so good. And then we can give... You can have the golden egg. Oh, whoops. Okay, so this is a level 14. We're gonna do this one next. And we're getting close to the point where I might start jumping back and forth between Elheim. Because the levels are starting to match up. I don't want to be overleveled for missions, so I'm gonna be jumping around quite a bit, I feel like. In order to just make sure that we're just doing the things that are at our level. And don't... Because I don't want them to feel too easy, you know what I mean? That miniature carving is just on the other side, I feel like. Maybe once I do the Tormented Helm, I can get access to that and finish that quest. We'll see. Alright. That's one that I'll want to do somewhat soon as well. Okay, anyways. Thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Have a good one, everybody. Next up is another prince. I'd like to give a very special shout-out to my patron supporters, Darren York, ZTD, Knife Namase, Kyle the Monarch, Chris Murphy, JW, Quinless, Vlada101, Andy Ford, Bruce Wizzle, Black Mamba90, Eureka Gecko, A Happy Fat Panda, Turkeyfoot27, Pedo Kuto, Shadow Raven, Hannah Kate the Great, The Blue Electric Cat, Emily Kuzanoa, Philip Dowdy, Timothy Jansen, Skip, and Nadia N. If you would also like to join this tier or any others, check out my memberships or my Patreon in the description down below.